Lidmar LMTV, Lidmar Television. Lidmar, your news starts now. Hey Lidmar, it's Wednesday, August 29th, 2018. It's Individual Rights Day. Here's what's going on today across campus. Our top story, it's one of the fastest growing groups on campus and you should be part of it. LMTV's Cash tells us more. Have you ever thought of becoming a mime? Are you good at sharing fascinating stories with your friends? Or maybe you love creating your own YouTube videos? You should check out Contest Speech. It's your chance to compete against other schools in a wide range of categories from acting to short film production and more. Even if you have a fear of public speaking, our minds don't speak. There really is something for everyone. Come find out what it's all about today after school in the lecture hall. If you have any questions or can't make it to today's meeting, see Mr. and Mrs. Fry or Mrs. Patterson. Everyone is welcome to join in the fun, especially freshmen. Maddie, back to you. Thanks, Cash. That sounds super cool. Tomorrow is a really important day here at Linmar. The academic assemblies are in the auditorium. The assemblies recognize outstanding students for their academic accomplishments during the past school year. Those being honored should have a received should have received a letter in the mail last month. Take a look at the seating charts today for tomorrow's assemblies. They are posted outside the 910, 1112, and main offices. The academic assembly for juniors is first. It starts tomorrow morning at 9. Seniors will be honored at 1030 and sophomores at 2 p.m. If you have any questions, see Honey Sue in the 1112 office today. And other news, girls, there's a new club on campus exclusively for you. LMTV's Audrey tells us more. Thanks, Maddie. Lindmark's teaming up with the University of Iowa College of Engineering to create our very own club just for girls. The Lindmar Feminier Club will have its very first meeting this Tuesday morning at 8 in room D131. The club is especially for girls who have a strong interest in science, technology, engineering, and math. If you have any questions, talk to Mr. Patterson. Maddie, back to you. Thanks, Audrey. The office wants us to remind you, juniors and seniors cannot leave the building during their open periods unless they have turned in their time release forms to the 1112 office. This form must be signed by a parent. We'll be back with more LMTV news right after this. Today's LMTV News is brought to you by The Roar Store, a student-run business bringing you the best Limar apparel and the accessories and brands you want. Stop by the store in the South Commons or see Mr. Brinkmeyer to learn more about The Roar Store. The Roar Store will be open to the public this Saturday from 8.30 to 11.30. Use door 13 in the South Commons. Stop by and check out their exciting new items for fall. And that's a look at our top stories at this hour. It should, it should be a great afternoon for a round of golf, and the freshman boys team will be on the course at Ellis as they take on Kennedy and Wash. Team dismissed at 115. On the scoreboard, varsity volleyball beat Waterloo West 3 to nothing. Junior and senior girls, tomorrow is the last day to sign up for the Powder Puff game. You must buy a $10 team t-shirt to play. Get the money to Mrs. Dayton in the cashier's office by 3 p.m. tomorrow. Girls thinking of going out for soccer, please register at lmgirlssoccer.com. This is for new and returning girls soccer players. And they're still looking for help with Saturday's home cross country meet. It's a great way to earn cords hours. See Coach Hoffman or Coach Goodell if you can help them out. That's sports. Maddie, back to you. Thanks, Megan. And news from the counselors. Have you figured out where the counselors' office are located? A 910 office is right next to door 3 at the Pride Rock Commons. Juniors, your counselors are in the 1112 office near door 13. Make an appointment with them at the desk. For more information on the, this story, stop by your counselor's office or you can check out their website. Now Aiden is here with the Arts and Clubs. On the Arts and Clubs scene, Linmore Model UN will have its first meeting tomorrow morning at 8 in room 156 at the Four Corners. Fellowship of the Christian Athletes meets tomorrow, morning at 7.45. In the Ox Gym, join them for fun and fellowship. FBLA, the Future Business Leaders of America, will have its first meeting at Friday, 7.45 in the Lecture Hall. Hey Juniors, 2019 Prom Committee applications can be picked up in the 1112 office. The forms are due to Ms. Crandall in the main office before September 6th. FFA is organizing a farm safety demonstration They'll have a committee meeting Friday morning at 7.30 in Ms. Lemer's room. 
That's us in club. Back to you, Maddie. Thanks, Aiden. Hey, Megan, what's for lunch today? Well, for lunch downstairs, it's rotini noodles or mini cheese ravioli with meat sauce. And the food court, for juniors and seniors only, is the pasta bar. That's lunch. Back to you. Thanks, Megan. Sounds awesome. Your LMTV forecast calls for a sunny and cooler day with a high of 72. Tomorrow looks sunny in 76. And Friday, showers and storms are likely in the morning with a high near 80. Now, that wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always available online. Just go to the Linmar website or follow us on Twitter. For the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Join us again tomorrow and have a fantastic day, Linmar.